Arrow, specifically our drones team, prepares for one competition the entire year, and that's the Unmanned Systems Student UAS competition. And this past year, Arrow McGill finished second, and the theme was solar panel surveying. And essentially, we had to configure our drones to fly above a solar farm. And we, using our imagery analysis systems, we had to detect which solar panels were damaged, which ones were missing, which ones were the most critical. And on the next day, we had to deploy indicators on the three most critically damaged panels in order to help field repair technicians um, assess the damage more quickly. I chose managing for sustainability because every single person in the program and it's one of the newest uh, majors to be offered within the DeSotel Faculty of Management, is that everyone has a specific vision about how they want to change the world. I have two passions. One is drones and one is agriculture. And this comes from having tinkered around with drones um, in high school and then having worked on farms during my gap year. And I didn't have my drone at the time, but all of the bosses whom I worked for said that there are so many different ways that drones can help out. Um, and then the next summer, I actually had the chance to bring my drone, work on a farm, and um, I was able to help out a lot in terms of building inspections, in terms of using my cattle to herd goats at night at sundown. I would just fly up the drone um, and we'd bring back all the, sh the sheep and goats. Um, and I think there's definitely a lot more ways to make a lot of money using drones on farms. And that can be with different cameras for inspections, that can be for crop analysis. For every 50 meters of your crops, you need to know the exact uh, cat ion exchange potential and all these, these different technical things. And drones are the way that um, you basically save a lot of labor.